Have you seen a decrease in the amount of business that have been funded by investors in the last couple of years? Oh yeah, 100%. Yeah. But like that's worldwide mm -hmm. um, because the interest rates are just so high. Mm -hmm. So VCs or, or just in general angel investors, you know, it's a, it's a tough hurdle to, to cross if, you, if your bank gives you 5% on, on, your, on your deposit. Yeah, okay. So, so achieving, safe money. Right? Safe money. Achieving mm -hmm. higher than 5% on risky business. Yeah. Like you have to be very good at investing and picking out the companies to be able to. Mm -hmm. like, and that's why a lot of like funding dried up. Um, okay. So mm -hmm. that's why you have all these rounds of layoffs in the tech world, mm -hmm. right? Like all these rounds of layoffs that you've sh surely seen. Yeah, yeah. Uh, it's because they can't get new funding, right? Mm -hmm. So they all have to get profitable. And I'm sure like companies or that you've worked or heard of like that are saying like, oh, we have to get profitable now. Exactly. Yeah. Before it was not the goal. It was like growth, but exactly. users, sales, but no matter how much you lose per sale, just... Yeah. Report more sales, and then suddenly we need to be profitable. Be yeah. profitable. Like, <laughs> oh, okay. Now, that's I mean, how no... do we do that? How do we do that? <laughs> yeah. Before that, it felt like a game, actually. Like, let's just play. We have an internet company, and it's uh, because I never, in the, in the companies where I was working before, I never pay attention how much money we were losing. I mean, I know we, I knew we were losing, but somehow there was always money, right? For, Christmas party year and summer party yeah. year and new computers. <laughs> I was like, all right, there's always money. And then suddenly I started to see and many others, oh, they, they're doing layoffs and now every company wants real profits. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. They, they require it's, them to become grown-ups. Yeah. yeah. And, and it's a course correction for a lot of companies, mm -hmm. right? And a lot of companies didn't make it or are not making it. But like yeah. I, the VCs are just, or just in general, like money is not so loose anymore. If you can get so much money from the bank, mm -hmm. uh, like with it sitting on the bank. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Um, when, um, but you, you kept your company small, right? Always. You never went on the crazy I mean, growth. We tried. Um, so, I mean, we did raise money back in 2018. Um, and, from the beginning of 2022, like we could have still started like, okay, let's get some more money. Let's try to do the whole growth thing. But like, we were always like, okay, well, we've got a good thing going here, right? We have cool developers. We have a small team and you guys all, I, I guess every listener knows mm -hmm. like the more larger a team gets, mm -hmm. the less efficient it gets, right? Mm -hmm. So yeah. our philosophy was very much like, okay, let's keep our team small. Right? Yeah. Let's keep it small and let's try to do a lot of things ourselves, be more cost efficient, be more, you know, also effective in our output. I mean, at the end, that's what a business is about, right? The the biggest outcome with a less amount of resources, exactly. right? Yeah. Well, that was, that's now. <laughs> 2021, when it felt like a game, it yeah. was about cracking the high score. Mm -hmm. It felt like before, like the... Like you said, like a metric of success for a company was how much money did you raise and how many employees do you have? Exactly. It's like, we have, we are 200 people. It's like, yeah, but what are they doing, right? It's keeping that scrappy startup mentality and mm -hmm. at the same time being profitable. And it's a lot of fun. It's, uh, yeah. I mean, I also I feel, for example, uh, the guy from Telegram. I, mean, yeah. I think they also run the whole company with 20 people. Oh, yeah. Like super small. Also, uh, match.com. They work with 10 people or something like that. It's crazy. Yeah. And yeah. it's crazy how much money they do. And he, they, it's like... Yeah, yeah. And for example, yeah, like the guy from Telegram, he said, I'm the only product manager. Mm. So, and I do the hiring. Maybe he overworks himself, but <laughs> he says, okay, I keep everything. Like, we don't need uh, 200 developers. I just need 20 good developers and that's it. And myself. And that's what the Twitter, uh, also someone I think uh, qu questioned Twitter about. Like, why do you need all of these people, yeah. right? was the same thing mm. yeah. what is Twitter doing just uh, yeah but at the same time they that, that guy was asking for new features that were no, impossible but the, to be able, but uh, the guy I mean the guy the founder from 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 Telegram because I, I was listening in this interview that he does with who is this guy who was in Fox News before Tucker yeah. Carlson yes uh, yeah he ah, interviewed okay. the founder of Telegram uh, okay. recently and then he was asking hey what about Twittering and then the guy from from Telegram he said yeah I, I talk with 
how is it going? Jack Dorsey. Yeah. Back then, and I asked him, uh, "You can do this whole thing also with fifty people." Yeah. And then he said, "And Jack Dorsey, he answered me, yeah, I know, but investors will freak out if I just starting to lay off people.' Yeah. That's mm. why he answered. Okay. Right? He's, he, uh, he's himself. That, he that says actually, that he admitted, "Yeah, I know, I can run this whole thing with fifty, but." No, exactly. Like, and I. It's also the same thing for us. Like three junior developers versus one senior developer. Mm -hmm. Like a lot of the times, the senior developer wins, right? Like so, and but the, does the senior developer cost three times more? Probably not. And it's more. If, and of course, like having larger the business is, the more waste it brings. Uh, like just coordination and talking, and you know. Um, and applies, I think, for every position, maybe, right? Like, I've yeah. heard that a lot from from uh, developers' perspective. Like they say, a senior developer is not like twice or three times uh, more efficient than a junior. It's like ten or twenty times more efficient than a junior. So it's like exponential. Yeah, what they they can exactly. do. I imagine that also for people in marketing or in other position in finance or whatever, it's the same thing. Absolutely, right? and I think everyone who starts a company. Um, with limited means with also with after getting funding you always have to ask yourself like you know what's the next feature that brings you to the mm -hmm. north star as, mm -hmm, they, yeah. as they like to call it yeah or the next action the next channel yeah it. in terms of uh, building a business and or raising a capital <laughs>